Hey, my name is Bhavani Kola. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, this channel is all about educational tools, tips, and technology. So if you don't want to miss out on those tools and tips, please make sure you subscribe. I was getting ready for my presentation and I came across this powerful tool slash toy from Microsoft that lets you focus on your mouse and highlights your left click and right click, which makes it so much easier for the audiences to follow your presentation. In this video, I will be talking about Microsoft Power Toys just because I wanted the first video of the year to be powerful yet simple. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into Power Toys. So the first step to use your Power Toys is to go ahead and install one. I will leave a link in the description box below. When you click on that link, that link will get you to this particular page and you might be having the latest version than I do. Once you're on this page, you scroll all the way down until you find your Power Toys EXE file, which is right here. Go ahead and click on it. Go ahead and download and install. Trust me, the download and installation process does not take you long. Once you have downloaded and installed, let's go ahead and see how to launch it. Once the installation process is complete, let's go ahead and launch your Power Toys. To launch your Power Toys, all you have to do is go ahead, type in your search menu, Power Toys, and here it is. When you click on it, you will have this Power Toys window on your screen. Now, as you can see, Power Toys has multiple things, but today we will be focusing only on mouse utilities. So let me go ahead and click on that. And as you can see, we have two options here, one that helps us focus on the mouse and the other that helps us highlight the mouse. So let's go ahead and start with the first one. Enable Find My Mouse. The first thing I'm going to do is turn it on. And in the bottom here, you have appearance and behavior. So let me check this one or click on this. And here you have an option to check it if you're a gamer. I'm not a gamer, so I really don't care about this one. And this is your overlay capacity level, how dark you want the background to be. I'm going to go ahead and make it to 60 for now. And you can change the background color. Here is your spotlight color. What I'm going to do is I'm going to change some settings here so you can see what it looks like. And we'll come back and change the rest of the settings. So once this is all done, I'm going to go ahead and minimize this one. And the way you activate your Power Toys Focus is by simply clicking on the left control button on your keypad. You got to click it twice. So one, two, there you go. This is my focus. As you can see, it's easy for audience to follow along when you're presenting. As you can see, the overlay is big uh, and the radius of my circle is big as well. So let's go back here. And I'm going to change the overlay to 50 and I'm going to change the radius to, let's say, 75. And I'm going to change the color to yellow. I think I like that yellow. And if you want, you can change the background colors too. Let's change it to light blue and see what happens. I'm going to minimize this one. And again, to activate it, you simply double click on your left control button. So one, two, and there you go. All right, I like that. So escape. I'm going to go back to the Power Toys window. And once this is done, let's go ahead and take a look at enable mouse highlighter. So let's go ahead and turn this on. Here you have an activation shortcut. If you want to edit it, you can simply click on edit button and type what you want your shortcut to be. Let's just say you want it to be Alt D or Alt X, but I just want to keep it to Windows, Shift, and H. I like it that way. So I'm just going to click on Save, but you can always edit it according to your personal uh, needs. And now let's go ahead and click on Appearance and Behavior. And as you can see, my left highlight color is orange and my right highlight color is blue. Yours might be different. Let me go ahead and change this to red. And let me change this one to green. Once that's done, the capacity is OK. The radius is OK. Now let's go ahead and activate it. To activate, I will click on Windows, Shift and H. And there I have it. Right click there. You know what? Let me change the radius to 50. So you can see. OK. There you go. Now it's 50. And. And you have an option to change the capacity. Uh, there you go. This becomes really dark. That's OK. I think 100 should do 131. Yeah, 131 should do. Or 150, why not? If you don't like the radius, you can always change the radius. So let's go back here. 
And let me go ahead and show you one more time how to activate your focus. So double click. There is your focus. Your left click and your right click. So once you're done with all your settings, now let's go ahead and take a look how to use this while you're presenting. So double click on your control button. So here I have it when I click back. And as you can see, my left click, my right click, my left click and my right click. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you feel as powerful as I do with this Microsoft Power Toys. If you do, please make sure you like and subscribe. If you think it's worth sharing, please go ahead and do so. There could be an educator who wants to feel as powerful as we do. Like always, happy teaching and please take care of yourself.